Hi guys, happy Monday. So I figured today, since I am extremely tired, I would do a come get coffee with me, which I'm very excited about. I don't know exactly how this is going to go because I'll probably have to hold my phone. I don't have anywhere to put it down that you can actually see me. So we're just going to try it and see how it goes. Hopefully I don't get pulled over for holding my phone. I'm very excited. I'm trying not to let my road rage out too because nobody needs to see that. So I also wanted to talk about a few things, um, one of which being when I posted that story about like what color reminds you of me, um, I had some interesting responses. They were very cute actually. I got a lot of purple and I got a yellow, maroon, and like forest green, I believe which was very sweet. I really like all those colors, so I was pretty excited. Um, but I wanted to know why you guys thought of those colors, like that they reminded you of me. So if you remember messaging me, just let me know why you thought of that color. Um, and then what else was I gonna say? I think I posted a story probably like a month ago, maybe about wanting to try the Morphe setting spray and I finally did and I like it but it's not I don't like it nearly as much as the fix plus especially the matte one that I was using that I'm almost out of so that is my opinion on that sorry if I'm like lost in space or whatever I'm trying not to die while I do this and drive um, so yeah, I like the Morphe one, um, it's like a very light mist, and it has a nice smell, it's like kind of fragrant, more like fragrant than other, um, face sprays that I've used, or setting sprays, um, but I just don't think it, like, holds my makeup as well, especially after using the MAC Fix Plus one for so long, and... Not even just the Fix Plus, the Fix Plus Matte really, really helps. I don't get super oily, but I definitely get some shine. And that, like, really, really helps, the MAC one. So I definitely recommend that. I recommend the Morphe one, I guess. I'm sorry, Morphe one, I guess, for if you're, like, don't wear as much makeup, maybe, or don't worry about, like, shine and that type of stuff. It would probably work better for you than it did for me. So yeah, that's my opinion on that. I have like a list of stuff that I was gonna talk about and I don't even remember now. Maybe it will come to me as I drive. Also, I'm like super tired today. I actually put a lot more, not a lot of effort, but a lot more effort into my makeup than I normally do because I was in a pretty good mood, you know, it felt like nice to do that, but also just because I'm very tired today, I normally get up between 12 and 1 p.m. every day because I work evenings and stay up to like 2.30 or 3, so I'm on a very weird schedule, so yeah, I normally get up super late, <laughs> I got up at 9.30 today because I had to get my car inspected, and yeah, so... I also heard that Starbucks is offering free coffee to healthcare workers, so I'm going to ask about that. Very excited about that. Um, so when I went to Volvo this morning, they have like just the best customer service there, like the nicest people. I literally just got an inspection and they cleaned, like they washed the outside of my car and they cleaned inside the car and they filled up my wiper fluid because that was pretty low. And it was just like so nice. Like I just appreciate that stuff so much. Um, especially just going in for an inspection. Like I wasn't, I wasn't, I was kind of expecting them to clean the inside of my car because they usually do that when you get like a service and stuff. But 
I haven't like heard about any other dealerships doing that. I thought it was so nice. So very happy to have a clean car. I did clean it yesterday, but I didn't like super intensely vacuum it like they do at a dealership. So I was excited about that too. I remember what the other thing I was gonna say was. Um, I also don't know how to edit these videos, so it's just gonna be either me silent while I drive or me rambling per usual. Um, so yeah, I'm trying to think of what else I want to talk about. Um, my sciatica is probably the worst it's ever been. It's insanely painful. Um, I've tried heating pad. I do that pretty much every day. Advil, which sometimes helps. Sometimes it doesn't really do anything. And then I did some stretching last night, courtesy of my sister who sent me some stretches and my nan who was telling me all these different stretches to try. That definitely helped, but it's still just like, no matter what I do is so sore and so, so, so painful. So if there's any nurses that see this or anybody in the medical field that can recommend me something to try for that, I would appreciate you so much because I am not having a good time out here. Especially after sitting for a while, it's just, oh, it's um, even more painful because if I sit in like a, even like a normal position, but also like any type of weird angle, it really, really hurts. So that's not fun. So pretty much I either have to be like standing or laying down. And then even when I stand or like walk, sometimes it like kind of spasms. So that's great, I guess, for me. So fun. Um, I hope Starbucks isn't super busy today because last time I went, it had an insanely long line. So fingers crossed that it's not. Um, what else? Oh, I totally forgot. I went to Starbucks yesterday and it was the first time I've gone in like weeks. And I totally forgot to ask about the healthcare, like free healthcare worker coffee. Um, and I waited in, so I went to the Bedford one and I waited in the drive through line for at least 10 minutes and my coffee wasn't even that good. I always get the um, caramel brulee latte and it was like weirdly watery for some reason yesterday, which was very upsetting after waiting in that line for so long. So I'm scared. Um, worst case is they are super busy. I'll just get a coffee at McDonald's like I did last time because Dunkin's is trash and I'll probably never like Dunkin's again. Um, I go through like year long periods of hating them and then liking them and like drinking them out of desperation because there's one in the hospital. But I just like, I can't make myself like their coffee. It's, ugh, I don't know. Plus it also like doesn't sit well with me team I but whatever um I do love their frozen coffees now they're called I got corrected every single time I still ordered a coffee colada like I used to when I was younger they just said oh frozen coffee so finally I ordered it as frozen coffee so sick of being corrected by the rude employees there that's another thing too all the employees at like Starbucks are so nice and then all the Dunkin's employees act like they just hate you and it's just upsetting to me because I try to be very nice back to them and I'm just like my energy is not being matched by these Dunkin's workers that act like I just ruined their entire day by coming to get a coffee <laughs> which maybe I did I don't know but I like to think I'm pretty nice to them and they're just not nice back so that's another reason I love Starbucks. Plus their coffee's actually good. Why are we going so slow? Okay, here we go. The coffee's actually good, unlike Dunkin's. 
I used to <clears throat> be in a huge McDonald's coffee phase because it's very cheap. And I got one last week when Starbucks was super busy. And <laughs> it's like really good. Like the flavor is good and everything, but it was really light. I'm like, is there any actual coffee in here? Cause it just looks like slightly like brown milk. <laughs> As gross as that sounds, it was just a very weird color and did I didn't even taste coffee in it, so yeah, they're kind of hit or miss, but it's cheap and it's pretty good, so we shall see. I'm getting closer to Starbucks, I wish it wasn't like on the opposite side of town of where I am at, but what can you do? I'm also sad because I just got my car cleaned, as I said today, and it's just not going to stay clean for long, like the outside of it, because of how disgusting it is outside and everything splashing up on it. So pretty sad about that. <sighs> Gosh. I'm like scared as I'm getting closer that they're going to be super busy again. It's kind of like an odd time to go, but I don't remember what day that was I went last week. Thursday? Wednesday or Thursday? At like around this time, which is like 2 p.m. and it was insanely busy, so you just really never know with them. So I'm praying that they're not super busy. I'm scared. Okay, I'm pulling up can't see over the snowbanks. Oh, <laughs> the line's so long. No. <laughs> All right, so now I have to go awkwardly turn around like I did last time because I can't do a U-turn right here. So I had to like go into Chipotle and turn around. Oh my gosh, I'm so sad. If I had just, if I had more time to wait, I would wait, but I do not, so. Very sad. <laughs> I'm really striking out with Starbucks these days. <sighs> well, at least McDonald's is cheap. I don't know when I'll be able to go to Starbucks again. Maybe I'll try tomorrow. What day is it? Monday? We'll see how motivated I am if I get up at a normal time tomorrow to get ready and go. As opposed to my 1 p.m. wake up time. Okay, that was a very short light. Thank you for nothing. I am really sad about not being able to go. Uh, we'll see what my coffee turns out like this time if it's just gonna be all milk again <laughs> i just get it made regular oh i did find this app too i wish i could like look it up while i had this open but i can't i saw it on tiktok and i think it's called cheat day and it has all of <laughs> <laughs> like who's beefing at me is Joey. Oh, that was funny. Um <laughs> I see that kid everywhere. I don't know how he always like sees me and freaking beeps at me every time. It's so funny. Um so anyway, the app is called Cheat Day and it has all like the or most of the fast food restaurants and the like healthiest quote unquote options. Um, as far as calories for, like, each place. Okay, what is happening right now? Um, so I was gonna look up, like, McDonald's on there, but I can't, because I'm making this video. Alright, I'm, like, turning around. Yes, I know. Alright, this person stopped right behind me. That's really nice. I'm clearly trying to get out of here. Please move, thank you. All right. I am looking at my backup camera in case you're wondering. Okay. That was 
was fun. All right, so I gotta go all the way back down to McDonald's. Can't see past the snowbank. That's another thing right now that's like kind of scary is driving when the snowbanks are so high you can't see past them and you just pray that nobody's coming and you don't get hit. <laughs> Why am I hitting every, whatever I'm going. I'm hitting like every yellow light right now. Okay. So yeah, so now we have to go all the way back to McDonald's, which is not far, but far enough back down where I came from. Starbucks has just really let me down these days. Very sad. I thought I had enough time, but apparently not. Okay, can you stay in your lane? Thank you. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's, it's, I think today is that day that it's like the, something about Aquarius, I don't really know like the planets align like hercules type stuff i don't know what is wrong with people right now people are just all over the road um oh my gosh oh my gosh what is happening literally this lady just somehow cut off like two cars and me and then this person stopped oh my gosh i need some coffee strong coffee that's one thing i don't like about mcdonald's besides having primarily milk is that it's not like strong enough to like resurrect me resurrect me from the dead but whatever i'm still not gonna get duckins because it never tastes good in my opinion no matter what i get besides a frozen coffee not a coffee colada oh my gosh Oh, also, I haven't posted a um, do errands with me yet because I haven't had any errands to do. Um, yeah, and I have no money, so that's why I haven't done that. But I will do that at some point when I have actual errands to do. I do want to get my ring cleaned, but that's not really an errand, I guess. Maybe I'll do that sometime this week and try to go to that Starbucks again because it's right it's in Bedford and it's right kind of right across from it so maybe I'll try that I have to call and see if I have to make an appointment to do that or not or how that works I think it's free from what my fiance said but we will have to call and ask why am I hitting every yellow light because everyone's going so slow <laughs> <sighs> Gosh, this is so annoying. I'm a little grumpy now because I didn't get Starbucks. Um, and everybody's driving like a crazy person and I'm hitting every yellow light. So, pretty annoying. Also, this is really awkward holding this and like talking to it because I feel like everybody around me is just watching me do it. That's why I'm like scared to like make a YouTube channel because I'm just too awkward and hate people watching me video so I feel like I would not be <laughs> very good at that but I don't know <sighs> I hope McDonald's doesn't have a super long line let's see it's always how it goes where you just hit every yellow light or red light imaginable when you're trying to like get somewhere on time um I just don't have very good luck and that usually happens to me also I hate driving like right next to somebody so I usually just rip past them because it makes me anxious and I don't like it and I feel like they're trying to race me and it's just weird so person behind me that I just passed is still trying to race me I feel like okay so we're coming out of McDonald's this person's in literally the middle of the road wow what are you doing okay so now oh my lord I didn't hit a curb but it's just like a weird 
turn into here. Okay. Okay, so the lights aren't bad. Cool. I'm just gonna move this one. Okay. So, I get a hazelnut iced coffee from here. Probably getting a large today. I'm very tired. It's probably gonna be entirely milk again. But we shall see. It still tastes good. But it's just not exactly what I was hoping for, you know what I mean? Let me see if I can like prop this up. Yeah. Not bad. You get a nice view of my chins. I feel like this line is always really hectic too with the two like sides to order from. There's always like people like cutting each other off and then just uh, kind of stressful. I need to get something to prop my phone up. This will be a lot easier. People today. What is happening? Hi, I can help you. Hi, can I please get a large hazelnut iced coffee? Large hazelnut iced coffee? Yes. Anything else today? No, that's it. Alright, come on down. Thank you. Alright, so it's 2.39 for that, which in comparison to everywhere else is very cheap for my milk with a splash of coffee. <laughs> um, I also used to go to Roman Joe's all the time years ago when I was working at Sam's and then when I was at Empire too, which was right across the street. And I loved it at the time because like the coffee I got um, tasted just like coffee ice cream. And when I got it, I don't know, maybe like six months ago or a year, Ago, like or so ago can you <laughs> this person needs to relax um and it literally gave me like stabbing stomach pain like so so bad um so I'm never going back there again to get coffee because that was truly traumatic for me so yeah never again I also don't know how I'm going to upload this video that's now like 20 something minutes because I thought when you made reels they could be basically like YouTube videos but when I went to do it it was only like it gave me an option for 15 seconds or 30 seconds so I'm kind of confused we shall see Yes. Okay. I have Thank you. Have you too. Alright, sorry about my car's beeping noises. Anytime I get even remotely close to something, it shrieks at me, so. So it actually looks like a pretty normal color today. I'm so excited. So, hang on. Oh, this is very hectic of this drive through Very normal color. I'm very happy about that. Last week it was like cream color. <laughs> it was pretty disturbing. So I'm excited. We'll do a little taste test. Make sure it's good. And then... I'm gonna go and drive to work. I'm trying to drive over a curb like I always do when I leave this drive through.
because now that I dropped that, I'm going to hit it every green line. Sorry about that. All right, and try not to freaking die. All right, <laughs> struggling. Okay, let me try to put this down again. Hopefully, not throw it this time. Okay, enjoy my chins again. You're welcome. We're gonna do a taste test. Oh, yeah, it's really good today. Thank the Lord. I needed this. Thank you. Oh, wow. So good. Definitely would recommend McDonald's when they don't have entirely cream. I can always tell by the color if it's going to be good. And she did not disappoint today very blessed very happy about that so if this video makes it to the light of day of the public thank you for watching my rambling thoughts and scary driving um and yeah let me know if you want to see any more of these where they're hopefully more organized and i can actually go to starbucks and show you what i get and eventually i'll do a do errands with me and yeah, again, I have no idea if this is going to make it to the light of day of other people, but we shall see. If it does, have a good day, everybody. Happy Monday. It's almost Christmas. I only have a four-day week this week, so I should be able to make it, hopefully. But yeah, thanks for coming along. Bye.